Mesa TV presents in three, two, one. Dateline Schools with your host, Terry Harrington. All this week on Dateline Schools, I have the privilege of visiting St. Clair High School and learning about the award-winning program that's offered here in the East China Public School District. And tell us all about it. My special guest is St. Clair High School Band Director, Micah Voltz, as well as senior tuba player, Aaron Buckley. And, and Aaron, this, award, this national award obviously is not something that happens all the time. What, what does this mean to you and your fellow students? Um, for me, it's a validation of something that I felt was true for a long time. Like, I go around and I've been to music camps and I talk to kids from other music schools. And a lot of them actually know about, like, the East China School District and, like, the excellence that we have. And I go and, like, I'll talk to other kids about their programs and they envy our program because of the kind of kids it produces. Okay, it's going to make you pretty proud then, doesn't it? Yes. Great. Micah, what, what was the criteria and what did you have to do to be uh, nominated for this yeah, award? It was a self-reporting survey, so you had to go through and provide all kinds of data about this, the programs that you provide, K-12, you know, from how many hours, how many kids are involved, what percentage of kids continue on as they go, uh, and just a lot of like demographics, background of the school district. And then they, they compare those numbers to all the districts that report uh, into the foundation, their, their same surveys, and that's how they come up with the best communities. Uh, so we were one of 11 in the state of Michigan to be awarded this. Wow, that's good. How many other um, were honored around the country? About you know? 300 total in the country. First time for East China Schools? First time for East China Schools, yeah. How about for, if you had known anyone else the in our area? The other district I know that has done it and, and been awarded that way is, is Anchor Bay District. Oh, okay. Is this uh, something that uh, you apply for every year, or is it, was this kind of a first-year thing? Or? Well, you know what's funny is Dave Teeple from Port Huron Music Center and, the, and a great gentleman was the past president of, of the NAM Foundation. And uh, he sends out the email to send to, to do this, you know, and I've seen it in the past and just thought, okay, it's, it's just not on my plate this year. Well, this year I said, I'm doing it no matter what. I want to see how we stack up. Mm -hmm. And, uh, well, what? Look at that. We won. <laughs> yes. Now, do you get like a nice trophy in the trophy case no, to put next to the a, football uh, trophies? Just a little award, you know, that, and, and then the recognition, you know, from the press and from events like this. And I imagine make you pretty proud, too. Definitely. Definitely. We'll be back with more tomorrow. For Dayline Schools, I'm Terry Harris.